Well, here I am, sitting in my car by myself, bored. I did a few errands, and I'm sitting at a park, having a coffee by myself. Loser. Loner loser. I have no brothers or sisters, or, or any relatives for that. Well, maybe one cousin, which I never really see much. So, at least I have some kids. And a, and a mother that lives in the basement. So I need to get out all the time. I'm very social and this this time of uh, the C word, it's really taking a number on me and everybody else in the world. Some people have it worse. Remember to be grateful. At least I have a car to drive. But sometimes when you're really down, you don't care about others and how unfortunate they are. You just like to have a pity party for yourself. We all do it. We have to snap ourselves out of it. So like I said, I'm at the park. It's a it's called Fairy Lake and it's a nice it's a nice day today. So a lot of people are walking their babies, their dogs. And of course I'm not walking, I'm sitting in the car watching. I told you I was a couch potato starting two thousand and twenty one. So having my coffee. Who who who's my boyfriend? I'm so corny. Corny, I said. I was said. watching a uh, YouTube this morning when I woke up. Her name is Gemma Louise, and she's from Britain, the UK, and I quite like her. I like a lot of YouTubers from England. Lydia, Elise Millen, Gordon, um, In the Fro, and Gemma Louise, and a couple of other ones. I just don't rem remember their names. There's one nice one that has two boys. What's her name? Anyway, it doesn't matter. I'll put them in the in the link. Uh, not the link, but I'll put it down in the description box. Anyway, so I was watching Gemma Louise, and she has a new kitty. And they're the cutest little cats I've ever seen. I don't know what kind they are. They're gray, and they have heads like little balls. But anyway, she was showing... She tries to make the best of these times, and she has a lot of cozy days, a lot of cozy evenings. And... Um, you know, she just sort of goes through the the day and the evenings, and she was showing that she fixed up her bathroom, and she put a little dresser in there and filled it with Lush bath bomb. And I love la Lush items, except I don't have a really good bathtub that I can sit in, like a soaker tub. So I don't bother. I do have some, I do have some bath bombs, but they're just sitting in a nice vase for one day when I have a nice bathtub. But I do use the other products like the salt, the skin salt scrub. Um, I do alternate the um, this this shampoo. It's like a cinnamon bar. It's like a soapy uh, shampoo bar. So when I was watching her do that, and then she started making muffins, I thought I would surprise my daughter and her son and bring her some muffins. She's, she's almost eight months pregnant, and she's down in the dumps, too, so I thought I'd brighten her day, give her a surprise. So I ordered um, Lush online, and I picked it up at the curbside. And it was done, like, in a half an hour. It was really good. Maybe because it's Sunday, I don't know. So I got her six different ones, and I went to the bakery and got her some muffins, and I put it on her porch. Hopefully nobody steals it. I did text her a few times to go outside and I made her watch that video too just to give her that that vibe so we'll see how she likes it so this is the lake where I'm sitting in front of it's just a small lake a lot of people go fishing in the summertime you wouldn't get me eating any of those dirty fish so all the people have gone there was so many people here a few minutes ago walking their dogs walking their babies yeah. Wow, I finally got my brushes that I ordered from SL Miss Glam. I've been wanting these a long time. Ooh, look at that, boss babe. Because I'm a boss babe. I'm a bossy babe, I'm a bossy babe. Oh, I'm happy. I'm glad she sent it to me this way because a lot of people were getting it.
in a brown box, and I really wanted it to be in my pink box. Now, how do you open this? Huh. Look at this. I got my nice pink box with SLMS Glam, Stay Sparkly, and then the Boss Babe brush set. Let's see how it opens. Like a little, like a little, ah, yep, that's what I wanted. Sort of a nudie blush. And they had the little diamond. Where is it? Oh, there they are. There's the little pink diamonds. Ooh, these look fun. Lots of uh, face brushes. I'm going to have to play around with them. These are the eye brushes. A fan brush. Another face brush. Ooh, this looks good. I have to see when it's out of the package. More eye brushes. And another face brush. Oh, they're so beautiful. I've been wanting these for like years. Like, not this particular one. This is her newer, her, one of the newer ones, Boss Babe. She's got even a newer one that's got diamonds all around the whole this whole bullet thing, whatever this is called. Those look nice too, but I don't need a million brushes. These are good. These are good. I haven't really bought a good set of brushes in a long time. So thanks, Steph. Excuse the beauty, I just came out of the shower. I used my Charlotte Tilbury uh, shampoo for the first time, and then of course I used the, the mask, but I just, the last time I put the mask on for like a couple of hours, this time I just use it after my shampoo, just like a conditioner, and my hair is soft. I put the serum in the ends, and I'm gonna let it uh, just air dry today, and then I'm gonna just run the curling iron in it at the end. But for now, I'm gonna show you my new products that I had got for Christmas, the fresh, um, rose toner. So I'm going to put some on a little cotton pad. So it's a nice sunny day here, but here in Ontario there's a state of emergency where the rules have changed, where there has been a lockdown, but now it's more serious where you can't even, like, can't visit anybody basically which you weren't supposed to do before. Um, I heard people talking that you weren't allowed to go outside, only if you had a dog and you could walk the dog. Um, I don't think so. I think we're gonna go for a walk. And then anyway, I was misunder I misunderstood it. <clears throat> anyway, here's the uh, rose, the fresh rose um, deep hydration face cream. I love this stuff. Look how, I've only had it since Christmas and I'm using quite a bit of it. It's not cheap either, you can't, you try to just use a tiny bit, it does go a long way. Anyway, so we're allowed to go for a walk with a mask on now. If you're a single person, like a single dwelling, you're allowed to, you're allowed to have a one, your one visitor, like if you live alone. I always put the, the the last bits on my hand, not to waste it. Oh, jeez. And um, yeah, so we're allowed to go to essential um, grocery stores, of course. I don't know how long this is gonna last. This is just, it's so mind boggling. Because even if everything goes well and the numbers go down and things open, it's gonna start over again. As much as I don't want the vaccine, I really do think that that might be the the only thing that you know is going to stop this this craze. Okay, so I've done my skincare. Let that sink in for a minute, a second. So I got my new brushes. I'm so excited. I waited a long time for them. Coming from the states, I guess. <clears throat> anyway, they're uh, SL Miss Glam has a YouTube channel that I've been watching her since she was living in Vancouver. And she's always had her own brush company, but now I finally ordered them. And I have to say they are really beautiful. I always saw them and thought they look so nice, but I wasn't sure of the quality, <clears throat> but they are nice and they're very soft. And 
I guess I like the detail of the color and the, the little diamond. So the, it comes with, this Boss Babe set comes with four face brushes. And actually, maybe five, because there's a fan brush as well, right? And then five eyeshadow brushes. And this one you can use for eyebrows or eyeliner as well. It's just so pretty, those little glittery diamonds. They're so beautiful. Okay, so we're gonna we're gonna start. I'm gonna put my makeup on, but I can't see without my glasses on, of course, so I have to really go close to see what each of these are. Okay, this is a buffing brush. I'm gonna make the weirdest faces. I'm not even gonna, sh I can't even see the number, so it's a buffing brush, okay? This one is a precise powder brush. Precise powder, yeah, that'd be nice under the eyes. It's good for anything. You could use it for blush if you wanted to. Okay, what's this one? This one is Precise Contour Brush because it goes a little bit rounder at the ends. A dome. Okay, this one here I can tell already it's a blush brush because it's on an angle, but you know, you could use this as contour or bronzer as well. And then of course, your little fan brush. Okay, now for the eyeshadow brushes. Good luck to me to see what it is. Angled, angled eyeshadow brush. I really should have got my glasses. Oh, here it is. Brow and liner brush. If you put them on a certain angle, I can see it. Okay, this is a blending brush. That looks good. This is a precise blending brush. That looks good too. I love that, that shape. And this one here is, it's just a, it just says it's an eyeshadow brush. So I guess this is what you pack the color on with on the lid. Okay, so, so I remember her talking about that she uses one of them, buffing brush, she uses this one for foundation. So I'm gonna try one side with this and the other side with my sponge, because I am really a, a sponge lover. A sponge lover. Are you sponge worthy? as Elaine says on Seinfeld. <laughs> Just putting my concealer. I can't wait for spring. You know, it's bad enough having the January, February blues, right? And without this lockdown and worry, I got my flu shot yesterday. I haven't had a flu shot in like, I don't know, more than 10 years because I don't really want them. I don't really like what's going in into them, but I'm getting older and I have had a few cases of um, influenza when I was younger. So I thought I, I better, plus, plus my daughter's having a baby. So I think I better have it. And I got a tetanus on the other arm so I couldn't sleep all night. It was killing me. This one hurts more. This is the flu one, and this is the tetanus, which the, the flu one hurts more. Wah, wah, wah. So here's my um, Forever Skin Glow Dior foundation. Okay, let's see how this goes. Hmm, I'm just gonna put one pump. One, no, a little bit more. I hate dirtying these brushes. <laughs> a lot of times when I use brushes, I can really see um, the brush marks. Not with this one. Okay, let's do the sponge on the other side. So I'm wondering if I could still go sit in a car and have a coffee by myself, or if that's illegal too now. 
I don't think so. I think it's okay because I'm not in the car with anybody, right? It's not like we're, you know, doomed and we can't leave, the, can't drive the car. You know, one minute I hear that the cases are aren't aren't that bad where we live, and then the next minute I hear they're they're worse. Like everybody's telling you a different story, and sometimes I wonder if the news is just trying to scare us, to freak us out. Oh, I don't know. I guess if you go to the hospital, you'll know what's going on. So they actually look the same. Both sides have the same finish. Yep. So you can use either one. So of course, I'm gonna use this one from now on for a while anyway. So pretty. Anyway, I'm a nut. Okay, so there's my foundation. Then here is my MAC Soft and Gentle powder. So let's see which brush I'm going to use for this one. I think I'm going to use, I'm going to use the precise one. I guess it's like a powder. Precise. Yeah. I just use it on my cheeks. Okay, I'm still gonna be using a couple of my other brushes, like my bronzer brush and my contour brush, because I like these. I like this one. This one's just, um, oh God, what is it? T Real Techniques? And this one here is an e.l.f. brush. I could only get this one in the States, though, at the time. What is it called? Stipple brush. Yeah, and I like them. <clears throat> so I'm gonna use, again, the Sephora contour and this one is in the color second chance you know what i can't really see today okay i'm gonna look in that mirror i've got so many mirrors on here going i put my makeup on so i don't feel more depressed because really i'm not going anywhere other than going for a coffee i guess if i have to look in the mirror in the car i don't want to get scared Yeah, you can't let yourself go downhill just because of this. You've got to get dressed, you know, clean yourself up, and you've got to make the best of it. Otherwise, you're going to go downhill real quick. And from what I hear, there's a lot of suicides around the world, which is really sad. But I can see why. I mean, if you have mental health issues, which we all have a little bit of it. I might have more than others. <laughs> but... You know, a lot of people are losing their jobs. They've lost their jobs. They can't afford to pay their rent, their hydro, their electricity. That's why I guess our parents always told us, save up for a rainy day and always have three months at least, you know, save for mortgage and bills, which I've never done. Because <sighs> I never thought this was gonna happen. And um, so that is for that. Okay, so now I'm just gonna put my eyebrows on and I'm going to fast forward this a bit because it's not exciting. First of all, I gotta find it. Here it is. And this one's the Cover Girl and I really like this one. I used to use the Anastasia Beverly Hills and I love that one, but it's $30. This one's seven and this one's in soft blonde. Took me a while to like it though. It was a bit waxy at first when I first, you know, when you first use it, and then it glides nicely. Same eyeshadow palette. <clears throat> so it's 
January 14th. God, we've got a long ways to go before spring. Especially that we can't see anybody or go anywhere. Holy moly. Do you know what? I forgot to use my new eyeshadow brushes. I'm so used to using these ones. Holy moly. Okay. Okay, I'm going to use this one. This, um, this is the precision blending. So I'm going to try doing my contour with this. <sighs> Ooh, it feels nice. Very smooth. Actually, my other brush here is, is the bristles are a little bit harder. This one's nicer. It's, it's really soft. dropping everything today okay so I'm going to I'm not even going to use the brush I use my fingers for this one because it's color pop and it's it's called bubbly and it's sort of a gel eyeshadow and it doesn't show up with the brush so I'm going to use my my fingers Try this one. I'm gonna use this angled one. I'm gonna use this angled eyeshadow brush. <coughs> <coughs> Sorry. To use the ouch, the brown, this color that I always use. Picks up a lot of product at once. These brushes are really nice. I really like them. So far, so good. I mean, they always, they're better once you use them a, a while, you know, so that the color packs into the brush. At the beginning, it's always sort of, you know, you have to pack on more, but this one's good. I didn't have to, I didn't have to put as much on with the other brush. I, I, uh, I have to go over and over it. Okay, so put my mascara on. See you soon. So I'm back and my hair is dry. I let it air dry and I put a curling iron in a few bits just to give it less of a kinky look, like so that it's more of a wavy look. Yes, so I can go and sit in the car and have a coffee. So let's see, what color lipstick shall I use? I'm always using the same colors. I'm so boring. Yep, it's always cream cup. Here's a nice one, it's by Dior. It's called Habart. Come on, Susan, get it straight. Hassad, Hassad. Okay, I am going to use my Charlotte Tilbury Iconic Nude Liner. It's 
It's almost gone, look. Mm, my lips are dry. You know, I put so much um, lip balm on my lips in the day, at night, and I still have dry lips. My daughter says it's because I wear too much lipstick that it dries my lips out, maybe. Who knows? Anyway, so it looks like I'm not going to the hairdresser for a long time. So this is the look, <laughs> the dark root look. That's okay. Yeah, so the shampoo ma made my hair really nice. Well, the treatment, the mask did as well. So I'm excited. I'm going to, but I am going to alternate. Like I'm going to use one week, I'm going to use the Colleen Rothschild. And then the next week I'm going to use Monate because I do love Monate. And I'm not going to give it up because I love it. And it does make my hair grow, I think. I hope. So, so hope you liked that video. And I'm going to go, go clean up the dishes because there's usually a mess when I get downstairs. And I'm going to go ask my mother what she wants to do with her mess. And um, then I'm going to go for a coffee. So we'll talk to you later. See you later. Bye for now.